Welcome to the jungle. Grecia, hi girl. How are you? Hi. Hey, Ali, how are you, Ali? Hi, teacher. Hey, yeah. hey, please don't cry. Yeah, it's because the, it's the last day. <laughs> oh, no, you're kidding. <laughs> no. <laughs> you're not crying because of that. It's, huh? it's kind of sad. It's kind of sad. <laughs> ah, come on, no. Ah, but are you crying? No. <laughs> No, no. <laughs> <laughs> and I thought it was because of Lulu. No, you're sweating, right? Yeah, yeah, it's very hot. Oh very my hot god. I remember when Santana was really cold, but that was a long time ago. I think more than 20 years ago, sir. Yeah. You had never <laughs> existed before. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but now it's really different. Uh, everything is very uh, hot in every Every, every place, place yes <laughs> yes well especially here in el salvador well there are some places that are really cold right yeah. like los naranjos yeah. for example that i think like, is near from you right los naranjos yeah mm -hmm. oh that place yeah. is beautiful mm -hmm. it's chalaterango beautiful. chalate yes yeah with a cup of coffee i'm happy yeah <laughs> what about lulu where and, is lulu uh, um, well well, she was there. I think she's eating right ah, now. Okay. Taking, uh, she was here, but now ah. I think she's dinner. <laughs> she's ah, dinner. Oh. Okay, she's eating her mm. dinner. Okay, so she's gone. We don't have to interrupt. Taking her. taking his dinner. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm. that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe I will meet her one day. Yeah, yeah maybe. I hope. I hope it. it can they, be possible and they could be uh, like friends with uh, with mr chestnut yeah 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 it'll be nice my baby boy <clears throat> that where is him i don't have any idea he was here but he disappeared <clears throat> yeah you know what oh my god you are <laughs> blessed between women you know because we have grecia yeah. and also miss janet and me <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, oh my I'm blessed. Of course, of course. Right, Janet? Hi, Janet. How are you, girl? Good evening. Good very evening. Fun. Very good? Yes, very, very well. Yeah, you uh, look like you're about to sleep. The... What? You're about <laughs> to sleep? No. I'm ready. Yeah, you see? You you're, you're, <laughs> your pajamas, right? Yeah. Yeah, pajama. <laughs> yeah. Those are like yeah. a cloud With pajamas. Clouds. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I thought they were chips, like, eh, 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 but no. They were like clouds, right? That's nice. That's nice, of course. It looks comfortable. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm about to say, you know, Ale. Yeah, it looks really comfortable. You need yeah. it because yeah. tomorrow is the last day before the vacation. <sighs> yeah, uh, I remember that. Yeah. Relax relaxed from now. <laughs> of course, of course. Yes, I remember. You know what? Uh, because I do not have vacation, so for me it's really hard to like identify what would be the last day of vacation, right? <laughs> but I have a neighbor who's also he's a math teacher from the uh, ET, mm -hmm. right? And uh, he told us uh, today, yeah, tomorrow is going to be our last day. Our last day for what is it? <laughs> uh, yeah, because uh, we're going to have a vacation. Ah, okay, so. <laughs> and I figure it out, yes, that it yeah. will be the last day, right, for all professors, for all teachers. Well, it's, well at least Spanish teachers, right? <laughs> yeah. Ah, you don't have at least one day of vacation? No, I don't. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's kind of sad. Yeah, it's because Sorry of my work. Teacher. Yes, it's because of my work. Mm -hmm. That I do not work he for, uh, for here. I work from another place, though. Oh. Yes, yeah, so I, yeah. I I do have the holidays there, but the main holidays, not all the holidays. Oh, got it. For it, I think the most recent. But you mean you mean holidays in another country? In another country, you work yes. Like 
Ah, uh, okay. I work for another country. I walk here, but my boss is in another country. So, so basically, yeah. uh, uh, it it depends of exactly which day they got off. I will have it off. Of course, if it's during the week, right? Because imagine the day off and it's weekend and I do not work on weekends. So no way. So that is not <laughs> going to be a day off, right? Mm -hmm. For example, mm -hmm. I think the, the closest vacation that I do have will be on May, which I think is the, is the Memorial Day. Mm -hmm. Memorial Day. Oh. When, the, yeah. when they remember the military that they went that? to the... Uh, you know what? Uh, I don't mm -hmm. remember exactly when he said uh, the date. I don't remember exactly the date, but I know it is the second week of May. Uh, let me okay. let me figure it out. Let me figure it out. Let me just a couple of minutes. Uh, Memorial Day. Oh yeah, Memorial Day, twenty twenty one. Let me figure it out when it was gonna be. Oh, okay. So he's, oh no. So in this case, Memorial Day will be May 31st, guys. That is going to, yeah, that is going to be Monday. Yeah, Monday, May 31st. So, yeah, <laughs> yes, Memorial Day. It's a nice day to, to rest. <laughs> yes, it will be a long weekend. Yay! <laughs> At least for me. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> That would be awesome. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that would be awesome. Because of course I will have a vacation, right? But until now. So. Then all day talking in English. All day? Today? Yeah. No, all the days. And all, every day, every day talking in English. Ah, yes. 24-7, my man. 24-7. 24-7 yeah. <laughs> that you cannot imagine. So I think it's, it's more like your first uh, language. No, it could. I think well, they are in this. No. In, in, they are together, Spanish and English, both at the yeah. same time. Both yeah. at the same time, uh, because okay, I, I, I. Yeah, go ahead. How can we say like um, lengua materna or algo así? Your born language or your mother language. Oh, okay. Yeah. Porque, uh, because, perdón. come on. Uh, 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 <laughs> Sorry. No way. Sorry. English, come on. <laughs> no, 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 no excuses. No excuses. Can you imagine, Janet? Uh, uh, 4K. No way. Uh huh. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Uh -huh. And mm, I, I, I lost what I'm trying to say. <laughs> no, try to recap a little bit. <laughs> Um, how, how it's another way to say that, uh, like our what? first language or our dominate language? I don't know. Uh huh. Uh, 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 you know that? No? Anybody has an no, idea? No. <laughs> no? Your first language. Okay. What native. else? Your native. Native. Uh -huh. native. native speaker. Yeah. Mm. That means that you dominated that, that language like if you were born, right? But mm -hmm. I think what he's trying to say is like um, the language that you learned since you were like a little baby, right? That one? Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. All right. And what will be the English for us? Or another language? So I don't know. It could be, you can say many things. You can say, um, native language you can say mother tongue mother tongue oh, okay. mm -hmm. so that could be many ways in this case is that what it means lengua materna mother tongue native language like that okay. so it could be like that many ways to express it many many ways but this too will be nice native one you're native 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 okay yeah. thank you <laughs> you're welcome all righty guys um, today's our last model. So, well, I'm enjoy being with you, to be honest with you. And today we're going to continue learning grammar because I know that you know grammar by heart. But hey, guys, do you remember that yesterday we start with, with a listening activity, right? And we discussed yeah. about that. Remember that, uh, that something had happened to a guy? when he was working? Do you remember what was the situation that happened to the guy? Any idea? No? 
Let's, uh, let's, uh, somebody stole his someone wallet. stole his wallet. Yeah, yeah, had stolen. All right, very good, Rafita. Hi, hey, Rafita. Hey, How are hey, you? Hey, look her. Yeah, exactly, Janet. Somebody has stolen uh, the wallet from his locker, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. When he comes back, uh, don't find it. Exactly. He said, "When when I came back, somebody had stolen." my Link. wallet all right so you see guys these two uh, actions i came back and had stolen actually there were two events in the past right came back because that is the past of come came simple past and had stolen what is that burton's had stolen that's that's past, stolen. Past, perfect. past perfect exactly past perfect. remember guys the present perfect is verb have and the past participle of the verb right but the past perfect is the past of the auxiliary in this case the past of have is had the right doesn't matter if you're using and the verb it. is in past uh-huh and the, the the main verb is have and in the past is had the so you oh. said uh, that is the auxiliary, right? But mm. the main verb is in past participle. Had oh. stolen, had eaten, it's... had spoken. So it depends. It's all that the you... same as present perfect. No. The, you remember oh, that? but the auxiliary, uh -huh. the auxiliary change. The auxiliary, mm -hmm. No. Basically, it's, no. Uh, the auxiliary change. Yes, you're right. Remember the present perfect, we have have... And let me check what the words are called, yes. And the past participle of the verb, right? Like I wrote in the chat right now. Have in uh, the past um, participle. But the past perfect, instead of have, is had. Had. And the past participle of the verb, had. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So guys, I want you to understand when do you use it? Because if you, if you remember the... Um, the dialogue that we heard yesterday, everything that the that the, uh, that the man said, everything was past events, everything. But I want you guys to understand that, for example, we're going to use the past perfect uh, for an event, guys, that occurred before another event in the past. And I will give you an example, okay? Um, let's pretend that. Okay, um, let me send you, let me write it right now in, in, in the chat. You said, when I came home, when I came home, right? Remember, that is past, simple past, right? When I came home, that is something that occurred in the past. Okay. Yeah. What had happened before I came home? Okay. Let me give it to you, that information. And now I'm going to use the past perfect. My mother, oops, let me put it here. My mother mm -hmm, had prepared the dinner already. You see? You and see? that's because the dinner was before the... Exactly, the Ali. Exactly. Oh. You see, two actions in the past, but one action happens before the other action. What in, in the sentence that I gave you right now, what happens before I came home? My mother had already prepared a dinner. You see? So two actions in the past, but we use the past perfect to express an event that had happened before another event in the past. Rafa, you're about to ask something? No? No. Okay. I'll, Iris. Miss Iris, yeah, no, tell me something. Uh, do you understand right now what I have explained? Eh, eh, what is that? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I mean, let me give you another example, guys. Last Saturday, no, I went to a party last Saturday, okay? Let's pretend that. I went to a party last Saturday. When I arrived, my friends had eaten all the pizza okay they didn't leave, leave me just a, a one piece and i was starving so what happened guys that 
what, what is the action that happens before our ride to the party last Saturday? That my friends had eaten all the pizza. <laughs> you see? You see how, how we use the past perfect? Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not complicated. All that I want you to understand is that we use the past perfect to explain everything. The two, the two situation guys are in the past, okay? But one situation occurs before another one. Uh, do you remember that the dialogue that we saw yesterday? Uh, there was one of idea that the man said. He said, I was working out and I have put my stuff in, the, in my locker. He said that I was working out. I was working out. That sentence, guys. I was working out. It's a simple past or past continuous? Uh huh, Iris. Past continuous. Past continuous, exactly. Past continuous. So you can also use past continuous as well. So I was working out. Okay. And then what happened? I was working out. Well, I was working out. He said, and I had put my stuff in the locker. That means, guys, that before you went to the gym and do all the stuff and all the, and everything you had gone into your locker and you put everything inside okay so that action happens before you start working out on the gym you see so i was working out and i had put my stuff in the locker but what happened i forgot to lock and somebody came and had stolen my wallet. You see? You see how it goes? Yes? Is it clear, Bea? Hello, Bea. Grecia, is it clear? Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. it's a clear yeah? picture. Okay. What about you, Bea? Is it clear? Mm, so, so. So, so. I know it's because you came a little bit late when I was explaining. Okay, don't worry. Okay. So, you, okay, let me use your example, Beatriz. Okay, let me use your example. Okay. When when I came or when I log to the English class, the teacher had explained how we can use past perfect. You see. <laughs> so what? So how, what? What is exactly <laughs> the information, Bea? What happened? Okay, you came right. You you came into the class right, but you are arriving to the class, but you arrive a little bit late. Okay, I don't don't feel bad. Okay, this is just for example. Okay. So, so what happened before you came to the class? That the teacher, in this case me, I had explained how we can use the past tense, or in this case, the past perfect. So that means that this action that I had explained the past perfect use happens before you log into today's class. You got it? Yes. Oh, let me okay. give you another example. I gave a simple example. Uh, yesterday, I came back home and my mother had already prepared the dinner. What happened mm -hmm. before, before I, I came home? What was the activity that, that or oh, the event that, that comes before? Well, my mother had prepared the dinner before I came home. So you see? The past perfect, we use yeah. it to, uh, for example, to explain that an event occurs before another event in the past. Is it clear? Much better? Yeah. Okay. But, okay. Uh, yes, Ali, go a, ahead. I, I knew past, it. Go ahead, Ali. Past, past tense and past perfect is the same thing? Mm, yes. Yeah. Remember yeah. that remember that in English we have past continuous, simple past, and past perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when I'm talking about past, it's past, past tense. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. So now let me double check if you if somebody can give me an example. Rafita. Hi, teacher. I knew you're about to ask me. Hello, 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 Rafa. <laughs> do me a favor. Can you please be so yeah. kind to give me an example about the past perfect use? Any idea? Any any sentence will be nice. Okay. No, uh... yeah. <laughs> I just didn't. 
see, when I came home, no, when mm -hmm. I came uh -huh. from work uh -huh. yesterday, mm -hmm. my wife mm -hmm. had for me a special gift. Had already a special gift for me. Oh, very good. Excellent. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. Because what happened first is that uh -huh. she have the special gift, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Very yeah. good. Also, you can make that sentence better, Rafa. You can say, yesterday when I came back from work, mm -hmm. my wife had but. Remember? That was a past participle of by. By, but, but, right? So you said mm -hmm. she had had but a special gift for me. Okay. Very good. It. Excellent. Okay. Good job, Rafa. Okay, Mr. Ivan, okay, what about you. you? No, thank you. What do you have for us? Hello. Hello. Welcome to the jungle. Sorry, welcome to the class. <laughs> okay. So an example of past, past perfect. Perfect. Okay. Yes, sir. I have work in that company before. Aha, uh -huh. but I need the whole sentence. Let me see. Remember, hey, Mercy, uh -huh. remember that there were two actions in the past, but one action uh, happens before another action in the past. So, I should like, Mm -hmm. Use one with past continuous and then with with past continuous or with simple past, either or is fine. And okay. then the second one with past perfect. Okay. While I was in your house, uh, mm -hmm. I have. <clears throat> uh -huh. While I was. Staying, or uh, oh, what? Uh, well, I was having dinner in your house. You can invent. Uh, I. Oh, I know somebody else. Uh, I I am not being able to to connect the the past perfect with the. Uh huh. Let me give you an example. Uh, that happens uh -huh. to another to another student that she was trying to use the continuous one. You can say, for example, let me give you an example. Then you maybe you come up with a different one. Um. Yeah. When I was having, I, 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 no, I was having dinner with my family. Okay, you know what? Uh -huh. That is the past continuous. I was having dinner with my family, and I haven't, I hadn't noticed, or I haven't noticed that my sister had called me okay. and left a message on my phone. Uh -huh. What happened? Okay, you were having dinner, but uh -huh. before you were having dinner, somebody had called you. Uh -huh. Right, the action occurs before, and you didn't know until you went and turned it on your cell phone and figured it out that it was a, a call there from who from your sister. Uh -huh. So she had called me before we had dinner as a family. You got it? Okay, can I have an example, please? I was playing with my family. Mm -hmm. And I didn't notice. Mm -hmm. I have. I had. I had split my soda in my father's t-shirt. Oh, no way! So he he got mad at me. Oh my! No, he, 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 he listened to him. He got mad at me. Oh my <laughs> goodness! Come on! Oh. And what happened? And that happens to you? Really? Yeah, uh, ah, I ah, just, okay. I just you were invented. invented. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 what's well, really good. Excellent job. Okay. okay. Very good. Very good. Let me check who else. Uh, Janet, can I have an example, please? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, come here here. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe influence the idea. <laughs> of course. Oh, yes. Good. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Pengen di sini apa? Exactly. Yeah. When the teacher uh, asked me, um, I was um, sending the formulario. Aha, but you are not using the past perfect there. Because remember, the past perfect is with had and the past participle of the verb. Okay. So you can when use the, the same idea, but in a different way. When the teacher was explaining or asking for, um, for the example, mm -hmm. I have sending. I have sending? I have, oh, I have sent. Sent. Uh -huh. the, Formulario, mm -hmm. formulario to Jason Bautista. <laughs> oh, to Mr. Jason Bautista. Okay, yes. very good. Excellent. Congratulations. Good job, girl. <laughs> and he's not there anymore. You know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> you, you see? That works. You got to comb your, your hair more frequently. Yes, it's <laughs> Excellent job. Very good, girl. Now let's listen to Iris, okay? Let's listen to what she's about to say. Yes, John, it's your turn. Go ahead, girl. You can do it. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. When I came home, my husband had to start a romantic song. Oh, really? Oh, that's so no. nice from him. <laughs> oh, ah, come on. No, but you were invented. Ah, no way. It, it, it was true. Example. It was an example. Oh. Well, in my case, uh, yeah, most of the time he prepares the dinner and the, and the, and the breakfast. Yeah, oh, that's nice. Oh, and Ivan says, oh. <laughs> very good, a good try. Grecia, now is your turn. Give us an example, come on. Hi. Hey. Okay. Uh, my son had never seen a lion before he went to a national zoo. Very good, excellent. That was really good example. Excellent job, girl. Woohoo! And Bea is like, okay. <laughs> Bea, I'm teasing you. Okay, Bea, what about you? That was your turn, girl. She's a cut frozen. <laughs> like that. Oh, she did it on purpose. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um. When when I arrive to my work, mm -hmm. my, you see, she did it. She did it again. <laughs> <laughs> she wasn't proper. I think something happened with her internet, right? Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Maybe we got to. Barnet, my barnet. Done my work. Ah, oh, that is nice. I wish I could have more partners like that. So, 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 what did you do? Huh? Uh huh. Rest the whole day, went to the yes. beach or something like that. That's nice. Uh -huh. That's really good. Excellent. You see, the, he had a partner that had done her job. Excellent. I wish I could have a partner <laughs> like that. Okay, very good, very good. Good job, Bear. Bane, what about you? What you have for us? Um, mm. um your best. Maybe some like a yesterday was my birthday and mm -hmm. My sister had prepared a party at home. Before you finish your work. Yes. Oh, that's right. amazing. <laughs> Yay, excellent. Very good job. That was nice. And Ivan says, woohoo. Okay, let's listen to a beautiful lady that I have a long time without listening. Miss Mercy. Hey, how are you? Welcome back. How are you, teacher? I'm so happy. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. You have time to listen to your co classmates. So come on. Okay. Do your best. Give us an example. Okay. And, and how the was? Oh. Yes. We're, we're talking about past uh, perfect. So you can use simple past 
or past continuous, and then you have to use past perfect. Um, she was studying English mm -hmm. in the living room mm -hmm. when you arrived at home. Aha, uh -huh. but now in that case, you're using past continuous and simple past, which is good. Okay. But now I want you to use past perfect. She was a student. Eh, no, was... remember the past perfect? She had. She had. Okay. Or she had she... already started a study, right? For example. Uh, okay. She had a study uh, mm -hmm. right at home. Mm-hmm. When? When uh, arrive. When when I arrive home. Yeah. Very good. Exactly. So that okay. means that she had. You can say she had finished study. Okay. When I arrive mm -hmm. home. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. That okay. means that before you arrive to home or to your house, your sister or the or your or your niece or whatever or whoever it is, it had already done another activity. You see? Oh, and and okay. had already finished. Okay. Thank you. Very good. Excellent. And who else? Uh, uh, Heidi, what about you, Heidi? Uh-huh. Missing Heidi. Well, um, well, uh-huh. You had finished uh, the cook. Uh-huh. You have finished cooked? Before what? Mm. Uh -huh. I get confused. <laughs> Aha, that's what I was asking. Okay, for, let me give you an example. And maybe you can come up with a different example as well. You can say, I had eaten, you see, I had eaten my dinner before I start my English class. You see? Uh, yeah. So so who, who who was the first action? That I already have my dinner, right? Before yeah. what? Before my English class. Before I started my English class. Mm -hmm. Or you can say, uh, I started the English class. Mm -hmm. And I had eaten my, my dinner before that. It depends how you can use it. Now, give me, an, give me an, a sentence. Any idea? Well... I have, uh, mm, I have finished mm -hmm. uh, cleaning my room. I have finished, uh -huh. mm -hmm. oh, I have cleaned my room. I have cleaned the room. Mm -hmm. uh, when? Before. Uh -huh. uh, before, when, depends. Mm -hmm. When I I don't know when, when I when finish I, the class. <laughs> mm, no, you can say I have cleaned my room when an earthquake occurred. Okay. That means like earthquake happens, but you already have finished cleaning your room, right? Before that. Let me give you another example. Let me double check if I can share right now my screen with you guys. So let me just get the minutes. There you go. I think so. There you go. Can you see my screen, guys? Yeah? Yes. Okay, that's awesome. All right. So, guys, this is the past events. So I want you guys to pay attention here on my left side. Okay. You see? Okay, let me double check. The, the easiest one is, this, is, this, is the middle one. So let's pretend that we focus here. When I came back, okay? When I came back. Okay, guys, let me ask you something. When I came back, is this a, an action or an event that happens in the present or in the past? Uh-huh. When I came back. In the past. In the past. In the past. Why? Because of, we have came, right? Came is the past of come. Okay, okay, so guys, this is an action that happens in the past or an event that occurs in the past. I came back. You can say that I came back from home, I came back from work, whatever. Okay, but guys, before I came back, there was an, 
another action that occurs. And what was the action? Okay, let me put it in a different color. Someone had stolen my wallet. You see? And this one, guys, had stolen. You see that we have it in bold colors, in bold letters? Yes, this one? This one, yeah. guys, is the past perfect. Okay, this one is the past perfect. So guys, listen, read this as sentences in green. The past perfect, we use it for an event that occurred before another event in the past. So what happened, guys? Take a look at this one, at this part. This one, this one, this one. Take a look at this one. What happened, guys, before I came back? What happened? Someone had Someone. stolen. Exactly. Someone had stolen her, his wallet. Exactly. So exactly. That's true. Very good, Janet. Very good, Ali. So that that is when we use a past perfect, guys, to explain that there was an activity or an action that happens before another one in the past. Because if you if you notice, guys, these two sentences are in the past, right? There are past events. But some, someone had stolen my wallet. This action happens first before I came back. I, I don't know if, you, if I make myself clear. Are you okay or no? Yeah, I think it's all clear. You, Everything clear. Like water, like corchata, Juancito? Like water. Like water. Juancito, what about you? What do you have for me? Juancito? Yes, like water? It. You got it? Yes. Okay, let me do something. I'm going to send it to you right now and writing exercise. Okay? And you're going to do it together. Okay? So don't worry. It's not going to be complicated. If we are 12, right? But with me. That means that you are 11. So I'm going to split it in two. Bear with me for a moment. <laughs> guys, what I want you to do here is I want you guys to complete the sentences in column eight with the simple past or past continuous form of the verse. That's what I want you to do. I will send it to you only one part. So don't worry, it's going to be fun. It's not going to be hard. And I want you guys to do it together. So let me know when you receive it, please. Let me check here really quickly. There you go. All that I want you to do, guys, is to put it in practice what we have seen. And basically, I'm going to send it to you right now. Do you receive it, guys? Yep. Yes? Uh, Is it? Yet. Not yet. How are you not yet. No yet, no yet. Oh. Wait a minute. Oh, well, maybe it's no good. Yet. Oh, wait a minute. Let me check if I can do it right now. I think it's because of the internet. No, wait. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Yes. yes. <laughs> well, I got to change it right now. Oh, oh finally. Do you receive yeah. it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, very good. Okay, so basically, guys, this is a really small, a small uh, dialogue, if I can say that. What I want you to do is just to use the verbs that are in parentheses. And basically, I just want you to use it, either simple past or past perfect. That's all that I want. It's not complicated, okay? Simple past or past continue form of the verse. Now we're go ah no, we're going to do something. Uh huh. We're going to do something. What I have sent you right now, it is the letter A. You're going to use simple past or past continue form of the verse. That's what you're going to do. Finish it, and then I'm going to send it to you another one that you're going to use simple past or past perfect. So on this one, guys, the instructions are that the one that I send you right now, you're going to use either simple past or past continuous because we're going to do like a like a review of of all the verb tenses that we have seen so far okay we're going to do a review right now i want you to use either simple past or past continuous on the one that i have sent you right now that's all with the verbs that are in parentheses are you with me 
Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay. Yes. So let me right now create groups. We are, oh, we are 14. So that means it has to be, there you go. Okay. Let me do it. Let me create it right now. Let me create four right now. And accept the invitation, okay, please, guys? There you go. You're going to work together, okay? You're going to help each other. I will give you five minutes, no more than that. Pancito, Grease, very good. Dan, Grease, is up the invitation? There you go. Hey guys, do you understand what you're gonna- She said past participle and- No. No. You can't say that. No, sorry. No, no, no. no. Has continued. Yes, what I said that is- Past continuous, sorry. Past continuous. <laughs> I confused that. Uh-huh. Past continuous or simple pass. That's all. Either or. With the verbs that are in okay. parentheses, we're gonna we're going to put in practice what we already have seen, and okay, then I will send you. Seen. Yes, and then I'm going to send you on the second exercise that I'm gonna send you. I will send it to you, simple past or past perfect. But right now, just focus on simple past or past continuous. That's it. With okay. the verbs that are in parentheses, okay? I will give you five minutes. For for the. Yes, Eduardo. For the verbs. For the verbs, exactly. Remember oh. that, for example, in letter number one, you have a tiff and you have into parentheses break, break into, and you have also into parentheses pick up, right? So you have two verbs that you were supposed to use. Do you have that? So you okay. need to select yeah. either simple past or past continuous. All okay. right, guys, let me double check with the other guys. Continue Thank doing it. Okay? okay, bye bye. We are good. Very good. Okay. Yeah, trying hard to. My, we're picking. I was we're picking. Pick it up. Very we're good. Picking up, I would say. Picking up. Uh huh. Mercy, Vane. Good. Picking. Uh huh. Picking up. Very in good. The, in the first, in the first one, we think, we think is a thief broke into our house last night while my sister and I were picking out. Excellent job. Very, very good. Exactly. Very good. Excellent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm not going to help you, okay? Huh? Okay. <laughs> Very good. You did a really <laughs> great job. Excellent. Good job, girl. Thank you. Thank you. Let me double check the other guys, okay? Great. Yeah. Teacher. Yeah. Yes, sir. What do what do you say here? It what will be I I went shopping or I was shopping. We are discussing that. Was shopping? I, think it's, I went. I right? think was. Yeah, I, I think was to because where where uh -huh. is for day and we yeah yeah and and went uh -huh. I don't know if we can just went here I went no. shopping uh, I would say I was shopping I was shopping yes uh -huh. I was shopping uh -huh, the the, uh, the past uh, uh, think about it because to be honest with you mm. okay mm hmm. Or uh -huh. it will be I shop. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, you gotta you gotta think it because not all the time you're going to combine the two, the simple past and the past continuous. Sometimes uh -huh. it will be a sentence or or um that could be only past continuous or only simple past. Okay. So you gotta figure it out if it's either or. Actually, I got to run this activity on the platform. <laughs> <laughs> so you, uh -huh. yeah. So you had to remember what did you do? Yeah. Uh -huh. I, I didn't get it right. <laughs> okay, uh, so you need to uh, figure out why. And I'm not okay. going to help you. Ha, come on. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's continue, guys. Let me double check the other guys. Okay, only one more minute, and then we come. Hey, 
Everything is okay? Yeah? Yes, yeah. Okay, cool. I One more minute and then we come back. Is it okay? It's Nadia, Janet? It's made me confused. Why? What it. happened? Because uh, the, mm -hmm. the verbs, when you have the, con the conjugation. Conjugation, yeah. And it made me feel confused. Uh, that, remember, Janet, that in this section that I send you right now, you had to use either simple past or past continuous. That's it. So you will need to like the verb in parentheses, for example, let me do it. Uh, oh, let me help you with that with the first one. You said, let me check the first one. It says, um, a thief. And it shows break into our house last <laughs> night, right? Mm -hmm. So broke in, right? Broke into exactly. Broke. While my sister and mm -hmm. I, you see, we have a clue there. While remember that that keyword while I can only use it with past continuous, right? Oh. So you said while my sister and I was was. Picking up or Not. where picking up? Where picking up? Where? Because you where said my sister up. and I. Two mm -hmm. people, right? Okay. So that's it. Two, two persons. Huh? Two persons, exactly. Okay. So that's why you need to like double check. And sometimes it is not going to be like that. Maybe it could be only past continuous or maybe it could be only simple past. So you need to figure it out which one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. One more minute that we come back together. Okay. Don't worry if you have not finished. Don't worry about it. Okay. Here we do have Mercy, Vanny, Bea. Great. Mm -hmm. Aha, uh -huh. who else? We're missing, right? We're missing people here. Who else is missing? Aha, uh -huh. Alejandro. Eduardo, Danny, Iris. Okay, guys, let's let's double check, right? What you have? Uh, Ale, could you please be so kind to read for me the number one? Yeah, uh, of course. Number one says that a thief. Hmm? Um, a thief broke into our house last mm -hmm. night while my sister and I was picking up a pizza for dinner. Was picking up or were, were picking were, up? Were, yeah. Were, were. Sorry, sorry. Very <laughs> good. Excellent job. Excellent job. Do you have it, guys? Do you have it the same? Yeah? Yes. Yeah. All right. Very good. Can I have a number two, Ivan? Oh. Ah, I'm joking. <laughs> okay. Let me hopefully, see. hopefully, you have it right. Yeah. You, you're going to revenge now. I shop with some friends yesterday mm -hmm. and I lost my keys. Okay, do you have it the same guys? Yes. Yes? I, I right. got I was shopping. I, who said I was shopping? Instead of the hand. Uh, me. I was shopping I with know. my friends <laughs> yesterday. I was and shopping. I, uh, I was shopping. Really? Are you sure? Mm. Yes. Uh, um, not really because let's read it read it everything and do, do you think that the second uh sentence interrupt the first one or no not really not really so uh, so it's wrong to say i was shopping uh -huh. wrong? okay yes exactly and, and, and you and can you see guys there was no when right Remember the when is going oh. to be the, yeah, remember the keywords, simple past when and past continuous while? 
Uh, yeah, and just a comma like divide both. Uh -huh. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Very okay. good. So number three, Rafa, what do you have for us? Number three, Mr. Rafita. Number three. Uh-huh, number three, what okay, you have? Okay, number yeah. three, I was driving around with friends uh -huh. all day. Okay. On Sunday. And I run out of gas on the freeway. Very good. Do you have exactly the same guys or no? Yeah, but... Yes. Uh, uh -huh. It's the same case than, than uh -huh. the last one. Uh-huh, exactly. But what, why yeah. this one is right? I didn't say it was right. Okay. <laughs> I said okay. Okay, I got you. Uh-huh. Aha, uh aha, -huh. uh -huh, Ivan. Come on. <laughs> uh -huh. Shame on you. I'm not just kidding. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So what do you think, guys? Do you have the same of Rafito or you have a different way? I have it in the same way because we were in the same team. Exactly. Uh -huh. But now that you explained the, the previous one, uh -huh. we you got probably it. need to, to change it. Uh, okay. You see, that's why we're doing these exercises. Yeah, very good. Excellent. And the last one, number four. Uh, yes. Sorry. Yes. No, uh, sorry. Uh, but uh -huh. when the car ran out of gas, that not interrupt that first action? I don't think so. No. No. Okay. <laughs> well, not from my point of view, right? But it depends on you. <laughs> yeah, I think it depends. I don't know. <laughs> okay. No, but that's cool. That's good. And that's I, I want you to think. That's very good. Excellent. No, but it was it was the same case of number two. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Thank you, bitch. All right. No, thank you, Ali. Okay. Now let me check who's gonna help it's me. Sure. I have. Teacher, I have the do with the number you have three. Have a doubt. Who? Who? Doubt. Is, who? Gracia. Bea. Bea. Ah, Bea. Okay, Bea. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. What happened, Bea? In the first one, is I was driving or I drove? I drove. Drove or oh, uh -huh. drop? Okay. Drove. Yes, drop. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. What Thank about you. number? You're welcome. What about number four, Janet? What you have for us? Uh, I tried to visit my parents last night when I got stuck in the eleva elevator in their apartment building. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. In okay, the second part is good, but what happened with the first one? I got the the, the, the clouds when. Aha. Uh -huh. So yes, the first one was past continuous or simple past? Past continuous. Exactly. I was trying. Yeah, I was trying to visit my parents last night. When I got, you see, the second one interrupt the first one. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. I was trying to visit my parents last night when I uh, got stuck in the elevate, elevator in their apartment building. Very good, excellent. You see, because because the first one you were you were in the process of the of the first action, but the second action interrupt you. So you see? Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay, guys. Excellent job. Now let's do together section B. Is I think I am sharing right now my screen with you, right? You, can you see it? Yes. Can you see yeah. it? Yeah, Instead right. of can you yes. feel it, right? Yeah. Okay. So in, in this section, guys, what I want you to do is to put in practice either simple past or past. Perfect, okay. The topic that we just have seen. So let me double check, big teams or volunteers? I'm <laughs> just kidding. All right, Ale, <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's read, let's read it. <laughs> Luckily, comma, I, a friend of copy of them, and she and left me into my apartment. So what do you think? Um, Luckily. Luckily. I gave a uh -huh. friend uh -huh. a copy of them mm -hmm. and she um, had came uh -huh. over and let uh -huh. me into my apartment. I don't know. Okay. All right. Have... Any... Uh -huh. Ah, sorry. I uh -huh. have given. 
Aha. I have given. I have given. Very good. A friend, a copy of I them. I have given a friend of a copy of them. Uh -huh, of them. We can talk about the and key, right? And she came over. And, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. She came over and led me into my apartment. Yeah, very good job. Excellent, Mr. Ali. You rock. All right. Another <laughs> big team, not another volunteer. Uh, 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 Mercy, do you want to do number letter B? Just give a try. Mm -hmm. Merci, 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 merci. She's gone. <laughs> I think so, right? Yes, done. Okay, I think she's gone. What about you, Ivan? Can you try letter B? Let's see. It reached the fifth floor when it stopped. Mm -hmm. It it Sorry? was reaching the fifth floor when it stopped. No, but the letter B, you have uh -huh. to use simple past or past perfect form of the verse. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. It reached the... It reached or it had reached. Okay, it had reached the fifth floor when it stopped. When it stopped, uh-huh, continue. And af after I? After I was stuck. Mm -hmm. After I was stuck or after I had stuck? I had stuck. For an hour? After I had stuck for an hour, mm -hmm. someone started, started it again very good it was a little bit hard right yeah, yeah yeah i know but that's why i asked you to do it very good job ivan excellent what about letter c uh rafa you want to try rafa okay let me try do your best i guess we leave it the door unlocked them because that's how the thief, how the thief. Uh -huh. How the thief? How the thief get, what? Get, get into the house. Get into or got into? Got into the house. Got into, exactly. The second one uh -huh. is good, but the first one, I guess we. Do you think that I like, guess we uh -huh. left, left, we, left? We right? left or we had left? Had left. We mm -hmm. had a left. Very good. The had door, left. Yeah, the door and lock it because mm -hmm. that's how the thief got, got into the house. Very good, Rafa. Exactly. Okay. Very good. And last but not least, uh, Bane, you want to try the last one? Okay, Miss. Um, fortunately, uh, fortunately mm -hmm. I had brought my cell phone with me, mm -hmm. so I called my brother for help. Very good. Do you have it the same, guys? Mm, okay. Yeah. Yay. There you yeah. go. Excellent. Good job. Okay, you see, guys, it's different, right? When you speak than when you write. It's different. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. But you know what? Very good job. Congratulations. Congratulations, all of you. You broke my heart, as always. Hey. <laughs> you know what? What a way to end this model, guys. It's amazing. Can you imagine that was the last class? Yeah. And you haven't noticed that, right? The time passed really fast. Yeah. Yeah. So you see, we have learned the past continuous. So hopefully from now on, you will be able to use it in the appropriate way. Yeah. Well, guys, I had to say that it was my pleasure. 
it was my pleasure to be with you, to meet you. Some of you already know, some of you that were really brand new guys for me. Uh, hopefully you have learned a little bit with me, hopefully. Of course. And I want to put in practice. I try to like continue studying, even though we're not going to be in the class, but try to continue listening to music in English, read books in English, watch movies in English. Remember guys, that one hour per day is not enough. You gotta go an extra mile. You gotta put yeah. an extra effort. So you will be able to continue and increase your vocabulary. Please try to read in English. Because when you read in English, you increase your vocabulary. Maybe you're not uh, uh, improve your faster of speaking, but you will have more vocabulary that you will be able to use to express yourself. So please, I encourage you to read in English. I will try to see if I can search. I sent you guys uh, a link yesterday, right, about a book. So try to yeah. read it. I will try to search for another one. So you will have a variety of topics and you can decide which one will be better for you or which one do you like the most, okay? I will try to do it okay. my best. And of course, send you the information that I let you know about the difference of the verb tenses. So that will help you a lot as well. So guys, uh, I wish you the best. Please be safe, take care. I wanna see you next model. I don't know if I'm gonna be with you, but if not, you're gonna learn for another teacher. You're going to learn something new, uh, another way to give classes, uh, more knowledge. They have more knowledge than me, maybe. <laughs> yeah. So that would be nice. You will improve yourself a lot. Okay. Uh, okay well, thank you. I really care about you. And I, re and I was really, really happy that you let me be your teacher for this month. I'm really happy about you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. For the teacher. Thank you. Yeah. Thank Hopefully, you. we can see you in the next month. Hopefully. <laughs> And if not, you will have another teacher that you're going to learn a lot as well. Oh my God, don't throw me hearts because you're going to broke my heart. <laughs> <laughs> okay, say hi to uh, your family, to your pets, to your cats, <laughs> to Kalisi, right, Bea? To Lulu, <laughs> right? Yeah, right. <laughs> to your baby boy, Grecia. All right. <laughs> and also to your baby boy, Iris. <laughs> All right, <laughs> so hugs. And kisses. Have a lovely Bye. night. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank, Thank you, Rafa. Bye.